Guests, welcome to today's BB14 update and spoiler. Our house guest of the day is Hayden Alexander. Yeah, my hair is still a little wet. Alright, so I have more details for you guys from yesterday's POV. Like I said yesterday, Danielle won, so congrats, Danielle. Okay, so on to the punishments. I want to elaborate on a few things now that we know more. Frank is not just wearing a unitard, it's a spiritard. So it's kind of like this cheerleader outfit. It's like purple and white. He's got a skirt um, because we don't want to see that. <laughs> and and he also has to carry around these pom-poms. So they told him he has to wear it for a week. I don't know if that means like the rest of this week or and it like resets after the eviction or if it means if he stays this week that he has to wear it all the way until the POV next week. I'm not sure. But I know that Ian, who is, uh, he has to eat and drink out of dog dishes, also has to wear a dog costume, and he's living in a kennel in the backyard. He's got, like, a dog house and a little, like, picket fence area, and, um, he has to stay in the dog persona <laughs> for 24 hours, and if he wants to leave that kennel area, someone has to walk him on a leash. He can't just get up and go. So Big Brother told him, I think, if he had to go to the bathroom or something, he could look at one of the cameras in the backyard and Big Brother would like send this barking sound throughout the house and someone would have to go and get him. This is hilarious. They put a lot of thought into this punishment. It's kind of weird. And last but not least, um, Will did end up winning money. He won $5,000. So congrats. Okay, <laughs> plenty more uh, captain's hat captain's hats where that came from. Alright, on the strategy side of things, Boogie and Frank pitched an alliance of them, Dan, Danielle, Brittany, and Shane yesterday. And they want to be called the Avengers. <laughs> so basically this alliance is all of the coaches minus Janelle plus one person for each coach. That's like a lot of people. I don't know. Six seems like a pretty large alliance, but I guess it's still pretty early in the game now that it's been reset, so I guess you can have a large alliance. And uh, Boogie thinks that Danielle should use the veto on Frank and put up Janelle to get rid of her. Um, Shane and Danielle seem really sold on this. They're thinking, yeah, let's get Janelle out early. Dan and Brittany are like, Ugh, we're kind of in an alliance with her. They didn't say that but it's pretty obvious. Um, so they seem kind of down to maybe work with that alliance, but they're not really sure if Boogie is trustworthy. And it really comes down to Boogie versus Janelle right now, because if they keep Frank on the block and get rid of him, that hurts Boogie. If they put up Janelle and get rid of her, obviously that hurts Janelle. So they're not sure if they should trust the devil that they know in Janelle, because they know that she's going to run around and smooth things over with everyone and talk to everyone and make deals with everyone or with Boogie they don't know what the hell he's gonna do because he's never really had to play before because Will always played for him <laughs> so it'll be interesting to see how this pans out it seems like the newbies really are gung-ho about this and the veterans or the coaches are like no so we'll see this POV ceremony tomorrow is gonna be exciting it's <sighs> <laughs> lines will be drawn so that's all I have for you guys to, for today mom's going to be filling in tomorrow and I'm sure she'll do a wonderful job like she did last time so until next time much love <laughs>